we continue our series on self-esteem. The reason we're doing this mini-series is because many people in the PanicAttackRecovery.com community have revealed self-esteem problems. This makes sense because we believe self-esteem is at the heart of many problems. PanicAttackRecovery.com In our first video in the series, we asked you a number of questions. The bottom line was, do you think there are many areas in your life that would not be helped by improving your self-esteem? The point of these questions was to start you thinking about the benefits of improving self-esteem. We shared our belief that a healthy routine could offer a key breakthrough for sufferers. We suggested meditation since it helps with something called mindfulness. The efficacy of mindfulness in benefiting one's attitude towards the self and others is backed by research we referenced in the last video. By utilizing mindfulness in your life, you'll start to see areas where you have beliefs that aren't healthy, particularly with self-esteem. You can begin to change your thinking over time. It might sound overly simplistic, but it can work. Meditation and healthy thoughts about your self-esteem can be very effective because they can help to counteract those negative thoughts that over time have taken control of your self-esteem in a negative way. Another suggestion we'd like to mention today is hypnosis. Herbert Benson, MD, coined the term relaxation response. He was referring to the physiological changes that happen within the body when it's relaxed during meditation. Dr. Benson observed that during this period of relaxation, Physiological changes such as levels of chemicals in the blood, which serve as indicators for stress decreased, oxygen consumption decreased, breathing rates decreased, heartbeat decreased, and skin resistance increased. Dr. Benson surmised the relaxation response is a physical state of deep rest that changes the physical and emotional responses to stress and the opposite of the fight or flight response. This is very important because the relaxation response can be induced by performing hypnosis, which is the opposite of the physiological processes that occur during a panic attack. However, there is an abundance of research cited by the New England Institute of Hypnotherapy which illustrates the many benefits of hypnosis that go beyond emotional ones. Your brain can be subject to healthy suggestions given to it during hypnosis. Hypnosis doesn't require one to be put into a trance. Rather, you can provide yourself with healthier suggestions on self-esteem. There are many resources you can get your hands on for free when it comes to hypnosis. You can visit your local library or find credible resources online. We hope that you have enjoyed the second video on self-esteem and look forward to presenting a new video in the series next week. To make sure that you don't miss out on any of our content, please click on the card on the upper right corner of this video and subscribe to our free newsletter.